Hey, 42. Oh, don't let the pretty kitty hear this one. It's the uh, WFMD Ideal Hyundai Buick GMC of Frederick Pet of the Week. And uh, Little Shay joining us now is uh, Sean. And uh, you guys, uh, of course, uh, we also have a uh, wonderful deal. We'll talk about that from our friends at caninehealthsolutions.com. Um, that, uh, that we'll talk about that. But you brought us a pretty kitty. We did. It's two more days and... We'll be out of Adopt a Shelter Cat Month, but we consider all year round Adopt a Shelter Cat, please. Yeah. <laughs> but this I said is, only two, only two. Yeah, this is Basil. He is one example of dozens of kittens that we have at the shelter. We knew this would happen due to the snowstorms. The kitten season yeah, population was was delayed. So, <laughs> yeah, so you can tell Basil is very confident, very friendly, and typical like of a kitten. He's very s- smooth as silk. He's got like bunny fur. Yeah. There's very few, and there, the, the, not every kitten or cat has bunny fur, but he is one that, that does. And, oh, look, he wants to be a radio personality when he grows up. Yeah, um, well, <laughs> But very sweet. He's been in foster care, so he has, he's had the best of care since um, he was just about one or two weeks old. There you go. And um, very social, likes people, very friendly, litter box trained, the whole nine yards. And um, the foster, foster kittens come back, and their foster parents are always willing to talk to it potential adopters about what they experienced in their homes and often write up little biographies. So Basil is just one of many and he is a gorgeous um, little male about 12 weeks old and he's a silver tabby. Mm-hmm. So he's kind Got of a tail a, flapping. A darker um, darker than a gray tabby. Yeah, press a button. There gorgeous. Go. And there, and Walking he on the keyboard. W- yep. There you go. He'll be a companion. Walking on the board. <laughs> You can only go so far. <laughs> so if your listeners okay. hear this silence they'll know why it's a, an inquisitive kitten running around the studio. Oh, I see. Got the prayer box going. But he's adorable. You yeah. can tell he, they, his foster parents did great work. Somebody did good work. Yeah, Somebody and he came in with, with two siblings. They've been adopted, so we've kind of partnered him up with a couple of other kittens that are also still looking for home. So it's just a matter of being patient. Visit the shelter. Come in and ask questions. If you're looking for a certain color, um, we can, I'm sure, help you out. We have so many still in foster care. They are slowly coming back in. July, we'll see many more come back in. Now, an, an added extra bonus, if you uh, pick up a uh, if you pick up Sylvester here, what was what was the name? <laughs> Basil. Basil. Sylvester. <laughs> silver. You know, Silver Streak. Whatever. Basil. Uh, our friends at uh, CanineHealthSolutions dot com have a wonderful kitten box for you of uh, wonderful treats mm-hmm. and things that uh, they put together to give your uh, kitten a good health, uh, uh, good start. Absolutely. Uh, in your home, yep. uh, if you get a dog from the, you know, if you get this cat, mm-hmm. then what happens is you come by and you say, hey, look, I adopted this cat. Come by the radio station. Right. We'll give that box to you. So just yep. another added benefit to uh, help out our friends at the, uh, uh, the shelter to uh, rid themselves of not necessarily <laughs> unwanted pets, just pets who need a home. That's right. And, and this is a wonderful kitten. He's one, he is. I mean, absolutely. you will be, if you're looking for a kitten, this is a great cat for you to have. Mm-hmm. I mean, doesn't a, seem to be a problem. No, nope. he's got a very easygoing personality, and that's the other thing. We do color code our cats and dogs and kittens um, to let to help people pick out the personality that they're looking for. We so, should do that to people, too, color code them. <laughs> we actually do. We don't really mark it anywhere at the shelter, but, yeah, we can tell you who is. Um, but Basil is color-coded blue because he's just very easygoing, relaxed, and not too much spooks him. I found him on uh, find him on pet, petfinder.com. He may not be. I'm not sure if we can keep up with the number of kittens, but okay. he is at the shelter 1832 Rosemont. Yeah, if you go by and you ask to see Basil, you will not need to. You'll just go, okay, that's all I need. I'm taking him home. <laughs> that's right. That's all I need. All right. Thank you guys for stopping by. Thank you. It's the uh, WFMD Ideal Hyundai Buick GMC of Frederick Pet of the Week on WFMD.